for that matter, won't even understand what we're talking about, but uh, about the time kids have gotten about eight, nine, ten years of education, uh, they begin to realize that their parents lived back in the Stone Age and didn't really get a chance to know much. And uh, they are very sympathetic to their parents' plight, usually. And after explaining to them about how little they know, they uh, wind up going down the road through their choice or somebody else's a lot of time. I was 15 when I managed to uh, wish myself on the world, get thrown out of the house because of uh, ill behavior. And it's a miserable existence to uh, a person who, who doesn't learn ahead of time. It's really sad to uh, see the troubles that come and uh, see the heartache that's caused to the parents of those children. And it's kind of funny, you know? About the time that somebody's really grown up, they begin to realize that they didn't know enough to really try it on their own. Yeah, but when they're not grown up enough to do it on their own, they think that they've got it all put together and that they can do it. And uh, I know in my case, I'm back to back home to support my parents after the pressures that I had put on them it caused dad to have heart problems and uh, become unable to work. Just uh, too much pressure from children. So I was smart enough to leave at 15 smart enough to return at 70. And uh, I thank God for that. I worked, went to work in a lumber mill, provided them with an income. Did that for about two and a half years. Because I knew where the responsibility really lay. And uh, if we could just get that across somehow to young people, to just hang on and stay in there and not cause more problems than uh, that is absolutely necessary. If they listen to the word of God and honor their parents, they never have that kind of a sad tale to have to tell. Jesus loves 